caution tape still here at 30 Laurel Crest Drive and still an active scene as investigators tried to piece together exactly what happened and what caused this fire that destroyed this home. We were able to speak to two of the firefighters who went inside the house and saved the man who was in the basement and they say this was the life-saving tool that they used. Couldn't even see your hand in front of your face. Pictures from neighbors show the intensity of the fire, but despite the dangers, firefighters had to go inside. Someone was trapped in the basement of this Brookline home, and a rescue was their first priority. Uh, we took off for the door, and I was scanning from the time we hit the door because smoke had banked down probably about four feet, and we had fire whisping across the ceiling at that point. They headed in, Flannery scanning with this infrared camera. How long did it take to find him? It seemed like an eternity, but it was literally only about two and a half minutes. Could not see him through the mass straight ahead, but this actually picked up the victim and we knew where we had to go to get to him. They say this is an invaluable tool. It looks for heat signatures, and when someone is nearby, their body shows up like a white silhouette. How much longer do you think he even had in there if he hadn't gotten in there with that camera? Minutes. Minutes. The victim's sister was also inside, but escaped on her own, unharmed. As for the one they saved, he was rushed to the hospital, but firefighters say they'll never forget the relief they felt when they heard him gasp for air as they took him outside. That was a great feeling. That I don't think any of us can uh, put that into words at that point. Now, firefighters say this only costs about $5,000, pretty inexpensive when you consider the value it has for life saving. Reporting in Brookline, Heather Hamill, WMUR News 9.